Well, hello, my radio friends. Now, this video is going to be very short. It's just going to be a little tidbit, a little bit of advice on uh, when one goes to disassemble or remove this top cover on these AK-2 islands. Now, the brown colored insulation, that's very common. In fact, on the back side of here, you'll see this brown shellac covered insulation wire um, or wire insulation, have you. And uh, what happens over time, it becomes very brittle. And if tried to be moved, it will crack. Well, it just so happens the inside of this tube island is full of that same insulation going to your audios and other components within. Um, if one tries to just lift this, very commonly you're going to crack and all that wire is going to be broken. The insulation is going to be broken and you'll end up having to rewire, re-insulate everything underneath this tube cap. But I'll let you in on a little secret. If that wire is heated, not a terrible much, but if it is heated, it becomes very soft and very pliable, almost like rubber. It's amazing how soft it gets. So I'll tell you what I do when I remove these tube islands. Take your heat gun. I place it just like so for about 30 seconds, 45 seconds. Doesn't take long. You'll feel the heat blow out of these other tube sockets, of course. But that'll heat the underside inside where those all those wires are. And uh, I'm going to recommend you have your screws taken out first. Remove your screws so that once it's heated, you can simply lift. And you will be amazed how soft those wires are. And you could lift this, get underneath it, do maintenance like I did this evening. I replaced the grid leak. And uh, the wires remain with full integrity. Now, once it cools, once, once you move it to where you want to have it moved to, and it cools, it's going to harden back up again. So do your maintenance, reheat the wires again, and then merely fold the cover back down. And all those wires will remain flexible. The insulation will stay in place. And it'll keep you from having to uh, contend with broken, cracked insulation, which I guarantee you will have if you don't heat the underside of, that, of the tube island. So anyway, just a tidbit of information from Uncle Dave. Have any questions? By all means, feel free to ask. And of course, as, as always, until next time.